Blood is good. Blood is emotion. Blood is a story, a drama. Blood is what we want to see in terms of passion. What we want is a bloody good fight. Hi fight fans and YouTube viewers, uh, another prediction here from rope dope 1909 now I believe it, it's called, my, my new rope dope channel, anyway what a, what a mouth watering uh, fight we have here on the undercard of Alvarez and Mayweather fight, I mean uh, if it weren't for them being the, the if it weren't for that for that fight uh, being the main event uh, this in my opinion uh, would be the main uh, event wouldn't it the main fight of the card uh, Danny Garcia uh, versus Lucas uh, Matisse uh, Uh, I'm going to get straight into my prediction guys and before I, I go through the tale of the tape with each boxer uh, with you and tell you a little bit about the records I'm going to get straight stuck into my prediction now and go with a, a Lucas Matisse win by late round uh, KO on uh, Garcia uh, that's my prediction uh, and that's it uh, thanks for watching no only joking uh, anyway uh, when do when do we see uh, boxing fans uh, two fighters in their prime uh, fighting each other uh, you know we usually see a boxer in his prime and a boxer past his prime don't we but this, I mean, Danny Garcia, only aged 25. Lucas Matisse, only aged 30. I mean, 30 is uh, not old, is it? Uh, I mean, we see boxers now boxing until the, you know, in, into the in, into their uh, 40s, you know, with all the nutrition uh, side of things and. The box is now getting uh, great shape. Uh, the training side of it is just uh, phenomenal, and the coming, you know, most the majority of the box is in great shape. Uh, you know, I'm talking about the older fighters, uh, and you know, experience uh, counts for a lot, doesn't it? Anyway, this is a, a great matchup. Both fighters at the peak of their careers aren't they uh, just going through the the, the records uh, Danny Garcia like I said age 25 174 centimeters 174 reach I'm not sure about that one guys uh, height and reach says the same anyway Garcia's record 26 and 0 as we know with 16 wins by KO Matisse, aged further, 169 centimetres in height, 175 centimetres in reach. So I'm not, I'm not sure if they're uh, correct. Uh, anyway, the record, Matisse's record, 34 wins and with only two defeats. Now I'm not going to say them two defeats were against because. To be honest, I don't know who there was. I only know one of the boxers, and uh, I believe it was one of them. Them was by uh, Devin Alexander, and I just can't think of the other uh, guy's name who we lost to. But uh, wins by KO, 32. Both of them defeats were controversial losses. Uh, I read. Uh, I can't comment on them because I didn't actually see them losses so uh, uh, 
Matisse reminds me of a, a, a sniper boxer. You know, we see it a lot, don't we, with fighters that just uh, are just looking for that one punch uh, knockout. And Matisse, nine times out of ten, he's found it, hasn't he, with 32 KOs. Uh, it goes in in there with his guard held high and the, the way he, his, his stance is is he's looking for that big left or right uh, hook isn't it and Dan, you could say the same about uh, uh, Garcia, Danny Garcia he, he goes in there and he's got a phenomenal right hook as we've seen uh, when he dropped uh, Amir Khan uh, a while back now, over a year ago, I believe that was. Uh, so both guys are, are capable of knocking uh, their opponent out, aren't they? Uh, but more so Matisse, you would have to say. Uh, uh, if it becomes a, a boxing match, I also uh, think Matisse. Uh, I know it hasn't been shown, but I think he's an all-round boxer, in my opinion. I think he can box also, you know, win the rounds by points like that. Uh, and he's, he's, he's got an underrated jab, you know. When we do see it, it is a, a good jab uh, from Matisse. Uh, but in my opinion, I just... You know, I think, like I said, I think he also can win this by uh, boxing. And, you know, he'll have to obviously outbox uh, Garcia, won't he, to win the rounds. And, uh, uh, you know, get enough rounds in the bank to then go on to win the fight. Uh, so if plan A don't work him by getting the KO, I, I think he'll go to plan, plan B and... Uh, because you know uh, Garcia will know he'll be looking for a big knockout so uh, if you don't get that I think he can win by uh, just uh, outboxing uh, Garcia uh, but like I said that's my prediction guys a, a, a late KO by Matisse don't be surprised if it's earlier in the early goings of the fight but uh, taking nothing away from the, the main fight uh, this is a great uh, match up and I'm just looking I'm looking forward to this one uh, as much as I am to the main fight uh, uh, it's a great fight uh, I, I think you know because of the main fight uh, this one ain't getting talked up so much about as you know uh, Alvarez and uh, Mayweather uh, but it's going to be a barn burner as the expression uh, goes uh, let me know your thoughts of this fight I'm, you know I'm, I'm, apologies to uh, Danny Garcia fans and I'm one of them I just don't think it can last 12 rounds of uh, with uh, the lethal uh, Matisse uh, so uh, get commenting on this guys it should be a great fight entertaining fight uh, and you know an, an all round uh, night of uh, boxing uh, thanks for watching and let me know your thoughts of this one uh, uh, Matisse win for me uh, by late stoppage uh, get commenting and let me know your thoughts